here it is, the future winner of Campus Movie Fest 2010. We'll need some DVD cases. I know a girl that does some really slick cover art. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. It still needs polishing, so tell me what issues you see. Here it goes. Fade in. Thomas Harrison is a poor college senior. He needs a 4.0 to qualify for a scholarship to afford med school. He lives with two roommates, Scott and Brian, who share Thomas's organic chemistry class. Everything hinges on the outcome of finals in the morning. I'll have to study all night. Wait, 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 wait. What's the directing style here? Are we talking Michael Bay style, Zach Braff style, I mean what? Well, it's a little bit early to- Yeah, Zach Braff. Yeah, we should like Scrubs. I needed the A in organic chem, which meant I was going to have to knock the final out of the park. Need any help with that, Brian? I don't need any help from the star student in his orgo superiority. I would have passed that last test if you stupid great had it thrown off the curve. How do you help a roommate who's mad at you for being better at organic chemistry? Brain food? What? <laughs> if only I could swallow like that. Yay! That breath style's kind of a bad idea. I don't know, we should do it like, like uh... Carson, it doesn't... Ricky Gervais! Yeah, 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 yeah The yeah. Office, yeah! But... Wish I could swallow like that. Huh? That's what she said. Get it? You know, because of... because of sex. I'm going to bed. Bottle of sleeping pills. Empty. I never realized that Brian had trouble sleeping. You know, looking at him, you'd never realize that he was a, a narco... Necro... Necrophiliac. Sort of ironic, you know? Because I guess he's done studying and he can't go to sleep and I need studying and I can barely stay awake. Let's see you throw off the curve now. Good morning, it's another lovely day in Atlanta, Georgia. Today's weather, slightly cloudy with a chance of rain. I'm not ready. I haven't I've been asleep for 14 hours. Yes, well, sleeping medication can have that effect. But I didn't... Lame. We need something with a little more intensity. Yes. Yeah, you know? yeah, yeah, yeah. You're really putting the horse to the Tarantino! Yeah! You tried to stop me from getting my A just for a few extra points on your grade? Bingo. I must admit, I didn't think you'd last five seconds. Yes. Well, this time it's personal. Stop, 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 stop. Tarantino's too well known. We need somebody a bit more indie. Like Wes Anderson. It's personal. Is it? Oh, really? Because the last time I checked, it was between your superior intellect and the entire organic chemistry class. What? There's more than one person who wants to drug or kill me in a jealous rage? Jealous? Who said jealous? Okay, maybe I'm jealous, but I think it's only natural. Hey now, come here. No, Tom, you're not hearing me. We can't just sit down at a table and patch things up. This is some serious psychological bullshit, man. So what you're saying is... What I'm telling you, Tom, is that I'm tired of living in your shadow. Well, I suppose we could work on that. If you'll agree to introduce me to Lydia Ravenstein. Oh shit, we're late. Relax. We can score makeup with these wounds, no doubt. Operator, I'm going to need an ambulance when you've got a moment. Uh, my friend and I just had a slight misunderstanding. And then we do some crazy final like M. Night Shyamalan twist to it. Yeah, we're like parallel universes and stuff. That's besieged by time itself, which is eating their children. And then this huge eagle swoops down, carries them away to a...